Welcome to the second hour of this morning. Here are today's headlines. Korea's foreign ministry called on the International Atomic Energy Agency to play a proactive role in verifying safety and ensuring transparency of Japan's handling of radioactive wastewater from its Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. At the 9th ROK IAEA high-level policy consultation held in Seoul yesterday, the ministry highlighted that the Fukushima wastewater is a critical issue impacting the safety and environment of Japan's neighboring countries and the overall international community, and also discuss ways to cooperate on nuclear verification in North Korea. The president of the General Assembly of the Presbyterian Church in Korea, So Gang Seok, apologized to the public on behalf of churches for failing to promote the values and spirits of the times, handle social responsibilities, and set the right leadership. At a press conference held by his group, Pastors Ho, urged churches in Korea to communicate more with the people, suggest the right direction, and love their neighbors more by being on the side of social minorities. He also said the church will work with the Unification Ministry to promote inter-Korean exchanges with an open mind through providing aid to North Korea. The Justice Ministry is taking out the word alien from the alien registration card for residents of foreign nationality. The change comes after 54 years at the recommendation of the ministry's first social integration migrant mentor group launched in May this year. The ministry plans to call the card Residence Card starting January next year to promote inclusiveness. Finally, at a parliamentary audit yesterday, South Korea's National Intelligence Service forecasted that a structural change in North Korea's leadership might occur during the 8th Workers' Party Congress set to take place in January next year. It predicted the possible elevation of Chairman Kim Jong-un to the position of Grand Marshal, which is the highest rank in the North Korean military. People Power Party lawmaker Ha Taekyung said Kim Yo-jung may also see a promotion, but the NIS dismissed speculation that she is prepared to succeed her brother's rule. In regards to the two submarines currently under construction, officials reported that it will be able to carry submarine-launched ballistic missiles. And you can listen to these headlines once again on our YouTube channel by searching TBS EFM. Once there, you'll get a script of the headlines and subtitles as well. Coming up next, one-hour special coverage of the U.S. presidential elections.